Good morning. Oh, it's a pretty nice day. I will turn on the lights and everything here. Um, this is Tuesday. <laughs> I know the days for me are going really fast, believe me. It's like, I don't know why they keep going and they want to go and do so many things and the time is running. So, let's see. And today I'm doing something different. I will begin with a face mask. Let me show you what I'm doing. Okay, I'm using uh, my Moroccan red clay. I don't know if you can read there. I only need like a little spoon of that. You don't need a lot, believe me. These go all... And if you feel that it's not enough, then you will go with more. Then I'm using the rose petal, this one, and it's alcohol free and everything. You can do also with water. This one, this recipe I learned it from Pink So Foxy. If you don't know her channel, you should go. She always have very nice recipes for mask and lips, balm and all that kind of things. And this one was one that I really like, and I used it since the first time that I saw the, the recipe for this mask. It was really good with my skin. So, as you see, I just go adding a little and a little of the rose water until I have in the way that I want. Like, it's like a little mud, very soft. So. I have to be sure that I have the right consistency and I just keep mixing. And now I will add this one, that is the Desert Essence, the tea tree oil. You have to be very careful with this one, it's very strong and um, for some people it can be a little um, like a burning sensation. So I will say go for maybe one drop. Well, that was two drops. Um, don't put too much of this, it's really, really strong. And like I say, I, the first time that I have, it has a little like warm feeling in your face. So if you put more, then what you need is like really burning. It's almost okay there. I want to just mix up everything very good. Yeah, I think I have the right quantity. And now I will put in my face. Okay, here I am, ready to win a beauty contest. <laughs> So this mask is at least for 10, 15 or 20 minutes. So what I will do is my first workout, leave until it dried and then take off. My first workout is like 15 minutes and then I will go to do my um, my other workout. But for now, just the first one. And then you take with the uh, hot water warm water or just a rag, a hot rag with water, hot water. So, workouts now. So, this one is uh, about 21 days, super star clients workout, uh, the first week. And um, it's actually like a relaxing uh, workout with a lot of yoga. Yoga. <laughs> so, that is what I will be doing. Okay, time to do it. Let's do yoga. Okay, bikini, bikini body pilates now. Let's do it. And this is my fitness pal, the one that I'm using so I can control everything. Just go and look for the uh, workouts and everything that I'm doing. And then I come here and I put the information that I get, like for the minutes and how many calories all here. So it's my way to help my new um, journal. Um, it really helps because it shows to you how much you are 
consuming or how much you are killing with the workouts and everything is for me everything that I write gets in my mind and helped me a lot that was the best way that I have so and then in this way okay I will be watching Lori over 40 she's amazing well we work out let's do it okay today I can do only 20 with all the other stuff I just put in my phone and it say that at 20 minutes is 238 calories I'm okay with that for now maybe I will do more later I don't know and looking cooking Kat is making some baking cooking here uh, and I didn't have my breakfast so I think it's time that I go and have that okay I will do my my smoothie I'm using two-thirds of coconut milk I'm using this one it's the first time that I use this one I think I don't remember the brand of the other one <laughs> I always go and just pick the organic one and I don't know which one is which one then I have almonds it's almost almost quart cup I didn't want to put so much of that then I have a uh, old-fashioned roll um, oatmeal I think I will go for a quart yeah that will be enough um, I will put Greek yogurt or any yogurt that I have uh, strawberries and banana okay have half frozen banana there and I will I will put now like four strawberries I'm gonna cut in half don't forget to wash your strawberries of course <laughs> I did I did okay four strawberries and now I will use this organic strawberry uh, yogurt and you can go for the Greek yogurt if you want And I went for the strawberry flavor because I was going with the strawberries. So here we go. Just to be sure that everything is there. Mmm, it tastes delicious. And I have my smoothie ready here. This is like a breakfast blended, you know. Um, if you're wondering from where I get this kind of recipes, um, let me go to the cover of this one. This is the smoothie recipes for weight loss. It has a lot, many, many good recipes. I don't know if I showed you this before. I think I did. So it has recipes of odd kind, like uh, the green smoothies, weight loss recovery, um, protein meal replacement, all, all that you can imagine is a lot of these. So very good. So now I will go to drink my smoothie and continue watching the videos. Okay, time to clean all this. And we are still having this. We didn't work and put that. I have my decoration done for St. Patrick's. I maybe we'll show. I don't know. 
yeah, I can do a video for the decoration. <laughs> I didn't thought that would be something that I really need to do, but I got good comments and message. So for now, cleaning this, cleaning the floor, that is what I will do. Let's do it. Okay, floors are clean. Kitchen is kind of shiny. And I will just wait a little more until it's totally dry. Yeah, just a little more. And then I will clean the... Put everything away. Yeah. So, I will do my yerba mate. That is my Argentinian style tea. <laughs> and also I'm looking the recipe for the lemon squares. Let me see, this is from Martha Stewart. I love Martha Stewart cookies and everything. Look at that. It's perfect. Lemon, oh yeah, for this season, for this holiday. I think I will go for the lemon square. Sounds good for this green. <laughs> We're going to get the laundry. So, I decided to do my crust. I'm doing my crust there. I put it in the fridge there and then I noticed that I didn't have the lemons too. So my husband arrived, he already made the shoppings, and he is so nice, he went to buy lemons for me. I got people asking me about these, so let me show you. Yes, they, oops, they are growing. These ones, these three ones here, these three are my chamomiles, look at that. And these ones are just flowers. Um, I think I will take advantage of the sun, oops, so I will take advantage of the sun and I will put them outside maybe for a few hours, the sun is good for them, and here look at that, these ones are for the borders and these ones are just flowers, they are getting big, in a few I will have to take the, this part off, and because they will be so big for that. So I will move this in outside for now. And my little curious dog waiting for me there. Can you see her? What are you doing, Heidi? What are you doing? Are you waiting for daddy? Troubles. <laughs> okay, let's do. I'm just moving all the whites to. The dryer and then I will put I think I will go for colors. Okay, I have one hour and nine minutes for this uh, at least an hour for my dryer. Bigger. Let's go up. Let's go. This is my compact my <laughs> I would not open and show all the garbage of course. And this is my um, composter. And um, yeah, it has a little water there. About this, the good about this is like you can rotate. I was working on the this one I can show. See there? That is the old one. It's like shading out. It has all the old um, things, so it's getting like a it's composting from a long time. As soon as I feel it, that it comes to the other side. Yeah, it doesn't mix grow so <laughs> it's just like soil if you can see so this is what happened and what I do is from time to time I just twist them so they can get mixed and let me get the straw in here and also it can rotate more than that everything that I use for the baking is here clean now and I have other stuff in the dishwasher. And now I'm waiting for my husband. Beautiful day outside. I will have to clean this today, maybe. Maybe. Okay. Okay, while well, I'm watching the videos, I'm still doing my... Organizing my agenda. And let me put this a little down. So... And I have almost done this. By the way, I know you will laugh about this. 
I think that I know more than Martes too are baking. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But it doesn't sound right what they have and I did a change in this recipe. Um, to be honest, I threw the first mix because it was totally wrong. So I began to fix what I think is right. And also I saw some videos and everything. So I changed some of the um, quantity. Sorry, Mar Martha Stewart. So now I have this in the oven. I'm working also in my measures and everything here. Let's see how it's going in the oven. It's there. See that it has to get a little brownish in the corners. Not ready yet. Let's wait a little more. Going down. Hmm. I hope that's good. Lunch for today. The molly. Hmm. I was hungry. And to complete my dinner, I have a tiny piece of lemon bar with half of the strawberry and two little slices of um that is um banana and my water so this is my greens <laughs> tumbler but um that is all that i will have i don't want to go with so much and i taste it when i was cutting by the way <laughs> and it is good the only thing that it has to stay in the free refrigerator because it gets kind of mushy in the top, but it's good. One more last batch I will put there and then I will relax. I will leave the last one for tomorrow. Oh yeah, relax time now. Okay, I will keep going on my um, catching all the videos like I mentioned before. It is I was 11 and I decided to do the last that I'm doing is another of my Argentinian tea and then I think I will be going to bed. I, we were watching The Boys with my husband. You know, it was only one hour, but it was good. I love The Boys. Argentinian tea. How the water going? That comes in my thermal. I cannot clean all the kitchen. I know it's kind of dark. My neighborhood is really dark. That there, I don't know if you can see what the reflection is kind of hard. But there, see the lights there? Those lights? It's a uh, what do you call that? A gas station. It's the only light that you see usually in the night. Everything else is dark. So I will keep, I don't know, I will play a little. That is what I'm playing. Um, so far is 10.46. Let's say that for tomorrow. So this is the weather for tomorrow. Hmm. With Wednesday 55, 57, mm, not bad, and I will have a little of sun, I hope so. And that is all that I'm doing, so this will be my good night for everybody, and I will see you tomorrow. He's a baby. Isn't that cool? <laughs> see you tomorrow.